This is a very interesting topic, and unfortunately a lot of people today are not aware of this. The ancients for thousands of years used incense. And uh, depending on the type of incense they used, for example, the incense that was brought as a gift by the three magi to uh, the baby Jesus, they brought uh, uh, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. The frankincense was um, Boswellia uh, the frankincense, and uh, that was a special type of frankincense. It's very expensive. I had found it, and I bought it. And uh, supposedly, it's a type of a thing that when you inhale it, it cleans out your lungs. So it was uh, also a medicinal thing, but it smells very nice as well. So uh, they had incense for thousands of years. Let's remember the incense uh, was also an offering to God because we know that it's the, it's the scent of God. Uh, God has a scent. It's a pleasing fragrance. Now, the analysis of ancient incense found at Famine Royal Temple reflects the importance of the incense trade along the Silk Road. Now, the incense uh, is not found everywhere. It's found in certain areas in Arabia and Asia. So um, it was very expensive also. Now, the team of researchers affiliated with the Palace Museum, the Famine Temple Museum, and the University of Chinese Academy of Sciences, all in China, conducted an analysis of ancient incense found at the Faman Royal Temple. And in their paper, published in Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences, the group describes what they found through their analysis, why they believe their findings reflect the importance of the incense trade to the development of the Silk Road. As we said before, a lot of people found it, look, the, the, the Magi brought it as a gift to the Messiah, okay, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Um, so you can imagine, uh, it was a very important and very expensive thing. Now, the Famine Royal Temple, located at the Famine town of Fufeng County, was built between the years 499 and 532 AD. It's, we're talking about the Tang Dynasty of China. For the explicit purpose of housing a finger bone from Sakya Muni, the founder of Buddhism. Excavations at the site in 1987 revealed a previously unknown underground palace at this temple. In addition to the finger, the palace also contained several containers of incense. In this new effort, the researchers turned their attention to study the incense. The researchers subjected the material in the containers to Fourier transform infrared spectroscopy and gas chromatography mass spectroscopy analysis. And together, the two techniques revealed the ingredients in the incense. In one container, agar wood and LME resin had been mixed, the latter of which was considered to be highly aromatic. Another container, container held a mixture of frankincense and agar wood, which is the earliest known example of special blending process known as hexiang. Also, most of the ingredients found in the incense are native to places thousands of kilometers from this temple. A finding the researcher suggests that highlights the important role that incense played in trade routes across China. Frankincense, for example, would have come from parts of Africa or Arabia. And let's remember, frankincense is one of the uh, three gifts uh, one of the uh, magi brought to the baby Jesus. Frankincense, for example, would have come from parts of Africa or Arabia, and the agar wood originated in India or Southeast Asia. The researchers suggest that the transport of incense could have been a major factor in the development, of course, of the Silk Road. The environment in which the incense was found suggests it was made during the Tang Dynasty. The texts from the period describing the mixing of aromatic materials have been dated to between 619 and 907 AD. The findings of the incense in the temple pushes its use back even further. And this was Proceedings of uh, National Academy of Science, Science X Network on FIS.org. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. And the actual name of the fragrance that the Magi brought to the baby Jesus was Boswellia Sacra, the holy frankincense that was brought to the baby Jesus. Okay, so uh, all of you, uh, you can find incense uh, wherever you are. You can order it and it will come to you. And you burn it on special charcoal. 
Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Finally, support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.